Imagine a world where your love for football and your passion for a good brew come together. That's exactly what happened in Wisconsin, where a pair of diehard fans transformed their love for the Green Bay Packers into a statewide beer sensation. Welcome to Crazy for Beer, a channel that is all about beer. In this video, we cover how a Green Bay Packers beer gained statewide distribution. It all began over a decade ago with Corey Bank and Aaron Nagler, two Wisconsin natives and lifelong Packers fans. They started Cheesehead TV, a podcast dedicated to their favorite football team, in 2007. Little did they know, this venture would eventually lead to creating a Packers-themed beer named Carry the G. Carry the G isn't just a beer, it's a homage to a phrase by Aaron Rodgers in a 2019 press conference, inspiring players to carry the Packers' spirit everywhere. This resonated with Bank and Nagler, leading to a partnership with Milwaukee's Gathering Place Brewing Company. The result, a beer that captures the heart of Packers fandom, available exclusively during the football season. This brew immediately became a hit among fans, beginning its journey in the Green Bay, Fox Valley, Madison, and Milwaukee areas. Joe Yito, the founder of Gathering Place Brewing Company, remarked that this was their first beer to achieve statewide distribution, a milestone for their brewery. But how did Bank and Nagler reach this point? Their story traces back to the University of North Carolina School of the Arts in the late 1990s. A shout of Gopal pack. From Bank to Nagler during a drama class monologue sparked a connection. Their bond over the Packers grew stronger as they watched games together, discussed football strategies, and shared their passion with fellow fans. Their journey took a turn when they moved to New York. Regular phone calls to discuss their beloved team led to an idea, why not share these discussions with Packers fans globally? Thus, Packers Transplants, a show about two fans outside Wisconsin talking football, was born. Cheesehead TV's growth was meteoric, becoming the first independent fan site to receive press credentials for Packers games. It filled a niche for Packers content for fans worldwide, a testament to their dedication and timing with the rise of social media. The idea for Carry the G initially started as a whiskey concept but a friend suggested beer instead. Gathering Place Brewing was the perfect partner. They rebranded their popular cream ale as Carry the G, with a kin design featuring a 1940s-era football player in green and gold by artist Brent Schoonover. Despite early distribution challenges, the beer's popularity soared, leading to partnerships with distributors to reach all corners of Wisconsin. Its success isn't just about the drink, it's about the community and pride of Packers fans. Have you tried Carry the G? Let us know in the comments. If you are crazy for beer, be sure to check out the links in the description for our line of beer merch and other beer-related stuff.